Have you ever seen those awesome cars at shows that look like they're from the future? Well, those are called concept cars. They're designed to be super cool and show off new ideas for cars. But here's the amazing thing. Many of these amazing cars never actually end up being sold to the public. Let's find out why. Super high tech stuff. So, these concept cars are often filled with all sorts of amazing technology and designs. But sometimes, these things are just too fancy or too expensive to put into regular cars. Making these cool features work in every car can be tricky and might cost too much for people to buy. Too pricey to make. You know how these concept cars are super flashy and high tech? Well, that means they can be really expensive to build. Companies need to think about how much money they'll make by selling these cars and if it's worth spending a lot of money in making them. Rules and Regulations there are rules that all cars need to follow to be safe and good for the environment. Sometimes the new special features in concept cars don't meet these rules and regulations. So car companies have to make changes to follow these regulations. What people want The companies that make cars look at what people like and want to buy. Sometimes the things in concept cars aren't what most people want in a car. If the companies don't think a lot of people will buy it, they might not make it. Making it real is hard. The stuff that looks super cool in a concept car might be really hard to make in lots of real cars. Building something fancy in one car is different from making it in thousands of cars. It can be tough to make them all at the same. Learning and Advertising Even if these cars don't get made, they're useful. Car companies use them to learn and test new ideas. They also show them off to get people excited about the brand even if they don't plan to sell that exciting car. If you liked the video so far, consider subscribing. Too Fancy Technology Concept cars are often packed with incredible technology and designs, but sometimes these things are just too fancy or too expensive to put into regular cars. Making these cool features work in every car can be really hard and might cost too much for people to buy. Super Expensive You know how these concept cars look super flashy and high tech? Well, that means they can be really expensive to build. Companies need to think about how much money they'll make by selling these cars and if it's worth spending a lot of money on them. Rules and Laws There are rules that all cars need to follow to be safe and good for the environment. Sometimes, the new special features in concept cars don't meet these rules and regulations. So, car companies have to make changes to follow these rules and that can be tough. People's Choices The companies that make cars look at what people like and want to buy. Sometimes, the things in concept cars aren't what most people want in a car. If the companies don't think a lot of people will buy it, they might not make it. Technical Feasibility Sometimes, the technology featured in concept cars is not yet fully developed or tested for mass production. Engineering challenges or limitations might prevent the seamless integration of these advanced technologies into a production vehicle. Experimental Features Concept cars often showcase experimental or avant-garde features that might not be practical or suitable for everyday use. While these features are intriguing, they might not offer the practicality or durability required for widespread consumer adoption. Market Timing The automotive market is highly sensitive to timing. Sometimes, a concept car might be ahead of its time or release when the market conditions aren't favorable for such an innovative or an unique vehicle, leading companies to shelve these ideas temporarily or permanently. Resource Allocation Companies might prioritize resources for developing more feasible, profitable, or in-demand vehicles over bringing a concept car to market. Limited resources might steer them away from pushing a concept car that doesn't align with their immediate business goals. Making is really hard. The things that look super cool in a concept car might be really hard to make in lots of real cars. Making something fancy in one car is different from making it in thousands of cars. It can be really tough to make them all the same and work perfectly. Learning and showing off Even if these cars don't get made, they're useful. Car companies use them to learn and test new ideas. They also show them off to get people excited about the brand even if they don't plan to sell that exact car. Plans change Sometimes, car companies change their minds. They might decide that the concept car doesn't fit with what they want to do in the future, so even if the car was great, it might not be a part of the company's plan anymore. Manufacturing Challenges Manufacturing a concept car on a larger scale might pose significant challenges. 
scaling up production while maintaining the original designs integrity and uniqueness can be quite complex and expensive conceptual limitations some concept cars are designed with impractical elements that simply cannot be translated into a consumer friendly vehicle without compromising safety usability or compliance with regulations brand image and public reception If the concept car doesn't resonate well with the brand's image or fails to excite the public, the company might decide against producing it to avoid potential damage to their reputation or sales. These various factors collectively contribute to the reality that many concept cars, despite their innovation and appeal, might never reach production or be available to purchase by the general public. Only for a few people. Some concept cars are made only for a few people. They are not meant for everyone and these cars are made to look cool and get attention and thereby build the company's brand image but they are not made to be sold to everyone in conclusion concept cars are like dreams of what cars could be in the future they are full of amazing ideas but making them real is not easy there are many reasons why these fantastic cars never become a regular sight on the roads still they play a big part in making cars better and cooler even if they don't end up in our driveways